What's up everybody, 915 Man here, hanging out with Paul today on his 90 gallon mixed reef tank. It was a lot of fun talking fish and looking at his tank. A uh, nice mixture of corals, we got sticks, euphelias, zoas, all kinds of coral. Um, also his fish are nice and fat, nice and healthy, looking really good. Um, so just hang out guys and enjoy the video. Yeah, I want to bring... I can turn off the whites if you want. I don't know if that'll help. Oh, that's all good. I was playing with my uh, ISO and the aperture on here. Yeah. Can you Special get any more fish? Fucker. I hate that fish. That's cool, though. That's nice. I don't have any anemones in here. Right, that clownfish is a bastard. <laughs> nice. every, time I, every time he sees a finger or a hand or something, he bites. Like, oh, fuck yeah. I can turn the flow off if you want to. Oh, that's good. I like how the T5 is. I'm like just running two T5s. These T5s, I don't know. They're still good. My, uh, that, I don't know, if that Cory 67 yeah. Mustang, he changes them out every year. I, I, I got new bulbs, but. I mean, I mean, keep running them until you start. I'm so happy I went bare bottom with this. It's so much easier. It's nice. Nice tank. What size tank is this? It's a 90. It's good. It's not, I'm, I, like I said, I'm, getting, I'm going bigger. I, I got to get out of this. Four on the top. Yeah, that's a good, I got that from Jimmy too. This is my newest, that green hammer. Mm -hmm. I love the Euphelia corals, as you can see. Yeah, I like that. I like the movement. I like that one when, uh, when CJ had them all, like. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to get them to grow. I want, to, I want them to grow into a big bundle. Of course, the torches are over here because they'll sting the shit out of those. This one over here looks really good. The green one? It's like a rainbow type of... Oh, this torch right here? No, but... Oh, sticks. yeah. That's my favorite coral in here. I've Looks almost like killed it. it like four times. You see on the, the left side how it's a little white? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And it, gets it keeps bouncing back. It's a nice, nice piece. And that green came out when I put these lights over the tank. It's good. And you already sold the uh, the hydras and all that? Yep. That cabbage coral, or that leather, is usually huge, but uh, you know how those things are. Sometimes they're... That's where the, the, the algae bunnies, he sleeps under there. Are you going to get any more fish for this day? Probably not. I think mean, it's pretty... I don't think it's overstocked, but it's like I got the cold tank, small that that cell phone tank. I didn't know, but that sucker gets like a foot. <laughs> I didn't know that. I wouldn't have gotten it if I knew that. Uh, this one dude, uh, Frankie, he has one, and it was that's an awesome fish. Yeah, it's huge to hit, but his was pretty uh, bossy. And those gobstoppers, I have some of those, but I can't get them to freaking grow like that. Those? Yeah, the ones with the pink ones in the back. If you ever go to Jimmy's place and you see the little frags of those, uh -huh. that's, that's where right. it's from me. I frag that thing probably once a month. Really? And that's why it's closed up a little bit because I fragged it. Mine freaking takes ago. forever to grow. Oh, those are awesome. I got a rock from uh, Saltwater Heaven and it charged me like 90 bucks. For those? Mm hmm Yeah. How many, do you, how many frags? How's that new skimmer? That's the Reef Octo? Yeah, it's, it's good. Yeah, I wanted to get a Jable DC a, pump. It's up to there the best. Everything, uh, as you can see, like everything in this tank is Jable. Where did you find this monster? Uh, <laughs> this is like from the those two little fishy reactor. These right here? The, the one ball in the center? Yeah, in the center. Oh, those are from uh, Bullfish Supply. Really? Yeah, they're just uh, one inch. Oh. I got it up there too. I thought those were like those um, Julian Sprung. Uh, they are, but they, uh, that's where I bought them from. 
what's in here in your uh... well basically this is like a nitrate i just converted into it like a nitrate reactor this is um matrix uh, fun matrix? Second, yeah yeah or this is just this is regular matrix and i mean i, I was running uh gfo and carbon in here but i was changing the gfo out the same time i changed the carbon because i just got used to it so i just combined it in here and turned this into like a I had an empty chamber, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. It's been working out, my, nit my nitrates were at like 20. Uh, as you can see, I got a lot of that matrix stuff in here, but after I put that in, they, they dropped down, they stayed at around five now. Yeah, uh, I know CJ talks about that pond matrix. If this is the same stuff, it's just a little bit smaller. Oh, okay. Yeah. Because that uh, that block that they sell is, sucks. Like, is expensive too. Yeah, it's in, yeah, a lot of people, I don't know if you, a lot of people have been taking them out and stuff. Oh, I, I, they, they've got to work, but... And uh, when I sold the light, and I sold my Radeon, I had enough money to buy a new Apex. Yeah. Which I'm glad I didn't, because they're having all these problems with... Did you read the yeah. files? Yeah. yeah. I'm actually happy I don't have a controller. I wanted. I almost bought a controller a couple times, but... At least for the first couple years. Because it makes you get under the stand every day, you know what I mean? Look oh. at everything. But, yeah, I will have a controller one day I, I was actually thinking about getting a controller later on but I had I told my wife I want to uh, one of those phantom drones so I'd rather get a drone oh really <laughs> those controllers are just crazy expensive why don't you just get the modules for your reef keeper yeah I have, cheap, I'm sure I have, I'd be win I'd win but I don't know got that have to have the latest and greatest yeah. disease. <laughs> yeah, this thing is I'm trying to grow that GSP out on the overflow. I have some different GSP if you want some. I'll bring it to you next time or whatever. It's a, it's, I didn't know that GSP had like a bad sting to it. I yeah, it does. It will mess up some sticks. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, that's why I fragged it. But I have, my GSP is like the, Yours is pretty wavy, but mine is like super metallic, I guess. Is it super green? Yes. Yeah, I tried to find it, but I have that's, some. Oh, oh, really? A whole bunch of crap. I like it. Dude, J Bo pumps, you can't beat them. Yeah, I'm trying to use my second RW, but my buddy sent me the wrong ends. The, the Pelfrey? Yeah. Yeah, that guy? Yeah, yeah he's, he's cool. So, I don't know. I don't even have that RW4 hooked up yet. I just have it in there because I had it laying around and I don't know. I think the foam in here is pretty good, but. Oh, this is happy. I can never get my. And I'm gonna make the switch to uh, two part soon. Right now I'm doing cock washer. Where's your cock washer in your it's bucket? It's right here, yeah. This is one thing my wife fucking hates. No, she just hates this bucket right here. But I'm gonna build a little shelf right here. And what what oh. auto top off are you using? Uh, it's a JBJ. Over there. Mm. I had the the Tunzi Nano, but I didn't like that it was on one sensor. Yeah, I had a lot of problems on my Tunzi Nano. I don't know. If it overflowed like it overflowed on me two or three times on my my Nano. And this is a trigger system sump? 36, yeah. It's an awesome sump. It's, it's really nice. Yeah. I was looking at the newer ones, but they're like five something. The blue ones? Yeah. And they have the green ones too. The but green like ones are okay. The only thing that the other ones I like about it is, is the drain goes into a compartment and it spills over into filter socks instead oh, of going, Yeah, yeah. you know what I mean? The new ones, right? Yeah, and the green one too. And it has a cover so it's not as loud. And my old Reef Octopus, I, I hated it because it was super loud, but this is pretty, pretty damn quiet. That's, a, that's their new one. The, uh, their newest budget skimmer. It works. Yeah. That bubble coral was one of the first corals I bought off of Jimmy as well. I had a bubble coral, but I killed it. Well, I, <laughs> I can't. I've done, I've done a lot of shit to that thing and it's still kicking, so... 
It's not green, but it's still pretty cool. I built that frag rack, and I cut the, and it took me forever to grind down the, I didn't want it to look ghetto, like, uh -huh. with the, yeah. you know what I mean? So I just took a. I see what you're talking yeah. about right there. Looks a little better. I just took some straight up pliers and cut them. Well, I, I, I did that, and then I just went over with the Dremel, and I just. Smoothed it out? it down, yeah. That's cool. This can be a frag rack. Right? Yeah. But the the doser is still in the box, right? Yeah. Hey, cool, man. Thanks. Yeah, that's cool. It's gone. It's gone. Yeah. And he doesn't get pissed because you don't have any sounds. No, he's not. He doesn't. He doesn't. No. He sleeps underneath this rock right here at night. He just hides in there and he just. Yeah, because. Uh... As you can see, I'm not an artist. The rockscape sucks ass. Actually, it's better than a big old rock wall. It's pretty cool to me. Fish have plenty of room to swim, and you got this euphilia garden going on. The trigger does look cool, but I'm it's like, a, I don't know how he killed him. He, he's honestly the nicest fish. The clown fucks with him. Like, the clown <laughs> bullies him sometimes. Say that, that's an awesome fish. This Blasto, I actually bought it that size, and I paid $14 for it. At the coral reef? Yes. Dude, look how big that coral is. Man, he hooks you up. Look at that pink bubble. I don't I think I'm going to go there on the first. I like it. I wish I would have had my... Some gel filters, but... That's good. I actually like the white look. Better than... So did you buy a 10X or? No, uh, four, um, four Blue Plus and two Aqua Blue Specials. These freaking fish are fat. Is that a baby clown? Is that a new clown? Yep. I feed this tank probably like five times a day. And what do you feed your tank? Um, because I, I use that algae extreme, the stuff that Tim told me to use. This is, these are the pellets and the flakes that I use. That's a oh, mix of Hikari and, and that pellet. Like the little Hikari pellets so the little clown can eat. And I use these flakes. And I'll put in a, a pinch of food probably four or five times a day with that. And at night I feed frozen. And my nitrates, they're, they're good. I'm telling you, I think that nitrate reactor is... I think that's something that some people want to do. Um, I don't know on Instagram if you're under, but I saw some, a few people making these Chato reactors. And That's pretty cool, yeah. Yeah, I was thinking about doing that for my 24 gallon. What, what, do you, what do you keep your nitrates out in your big tank? I don't even have a test kit. I had an API, and then um, the API expired. I so, used the Salifer. Uh -huh. I just got it. I just started checking my nitrates probably like a month ago. I should. I should. I mean... Just so I can know where I'm at. But the only thing that I'm getting is bubble algae. Oh man, I have a crap ton. You know, and oh, I just found out that bubble, bubble algae can. I love that fish. Look at that shit he just took. <laughs> <laughs> it's awesome though. I guess he was waiting for me to get out of the fit out of his. I didn't know that bubble algae can grow in good in a in a. It can just grow with without that many nutrients. Like once you get it, it just grows. I think it slipped in on my uh, frag a frag plug, that's how I, that's how I got mine. and then uh, just <laughs> taken over. And um, you can see it right there. It's there. kind of pretty, though. I mean, it's not bad. Uh, Marine Depot used my bow algae. I saw that. I saw that video. <laughs> you, you pulled that whole clump out of your tank. Yeah, I have a shit. Uh huh. How do you take, how do you get it out with the I uh huh. I have some long ass tongs that I got from. Uh, Amazon, they're like 20 inches, and then I got some of my wife's old uh, eyebrow pluckers, mm -hmm. psh, psh, and I pull them out, and then I, I, I pull the whole frag out, and then uh, I'm gonna start doing that some more peroxide dip, and just go it's hard. On, look at it's on my rocks, man. I can't stand it. I have like one emerald crab. I know I don't really like the emerald crabs, I had but an emerald crab, but I caught him, 
in the middle of this acro one night. Oh shit. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's enough to get. Yeah, I was like, nah, fuck that. Booty. I can't believe that dude's trigger fish killed this whole thing. It's crazy. Yeah, I was thinking, That's I mean, beautiful. they're nice. They're nice fish, yeah. And I saw the one that uh, Jimmy was selling, but I was like, nah. I think he wants to. I bought it from there, but I had, I had trade. Well, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Mr. Paul hooked me up with a three-stage uh, filter media basket. Um, it's going to be great addition to my 24-gallon all-in-one tank. And uh, stay tuned for more videos to come. I appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. You guys take care. Have a good one, guys.